proper excavation techniques are necessary to ensure a long-term functioning water management system. Trench widths should be just wide enough to safely place and compact backfill around the pipe while being narrow enough to utilize the strength of the existing soil. Trench widths for smaller diameter pipe will largely be influenced by the smallest bucket size available. The recommended trench width should include 6 to 12 inches of space on either side of the pipe, which must remain centered in the trench throughout the installation. When planning excavation, keep in mind that burial depths for mains can vary throughout the project depending on the grade of the pipe and the topography of the field. Installation procedures should be adjusted accordingly. Pipe buried 8 feet or less typically does not require imported backfills. Shaped trench bottoms which can be formed with a spoon attachment should be used provided the existing soil will hold a stable shaped trench. The rounded trench bottom should closely fit the outside diameter of the pipe to provide sufficient support to the spring line, which is the horizontal center line of the pipe. The dimensions of the rounded trench bottom for each diameter pipe are available from your Prinsco representative or at prinsco.com forward slash ag resources. It is important to maintain a consistent line and grade while excavating with a shaped bottom to ensure each length of pipe goes together properly. Another option some contractors have for a shaped trench bottom is use of a tile plow and boot for installing up to 18 inch dual wall pipe. For pipe buried 8 feet or more or under a roadway, a flat bottom trench with imported fill is recommended. Prinsco recommends 4 inches of 1.5 inch minus crushed rock or gravel as bedding for pipe diameter up to 36 inches. 42 inch and larger pipe should have 6 inches of 1.5 inch minus crushed rock or gravel for bedding. Safety is the number one concern when installing dual wall pipe. While excavating, be certain trench walls remain stable and safe. Follow all local and national guidelines for maintaining a safe trench. Remove rock or unyielding material one foot below grade and a minimum of six inches on either side of the pipe. With any pipe, groundwater or seasonal high water tables may cause problems, making dewatering necessary for proper and efficient installation. Again, Maintaining consistent grade throughout the length of the trench is critical to allow the water to flow to the outlet. 